CouchPotatoGM.com. That's the website. We are back mm -hmm. to give you verses. We're going to give you a lot of these coming up, leading up to the NFL draft. That's what we do every year, man. We just going to debate it, man. We have our top five positions mm -hmm. uh, on CouchPotatoGM.com on the website. Um, do our rankings. And we just look at each other rankings and say, yo, why is this guy up here, Drew? Yeah, man. Why, and, why is he in your rank? He's not in mine. And then we're going to debate it, and we're going to put two guys against each other. Mm -hmm. Right now, we got the the sexy. Is that what we call it? The sexy, the one and two, the the one and two, and the two and one, depending on how you look at it. Okay. Well, I haven't met three because oh, I got another guy. That's, that's terrible, bro. Yeah, I got. I like yeah, him. I know your other guy. We're going to talk about him in a minute too. Um, yeah, man, it's our versus series, and it's, it's we talking to sexy like Haley said. Wide receivers, man. That's why we call it sexy. Calvin um, Ridley. Calvin Ridley, that's his guy, versus uh, Michael Gallup, man, Colorado State. Um, listen, well, you want to start or you want me to? I just want to say, I just want to talk to just everyone out there, man. It's like, what's going on with Michael Gallup? Why, why don't people respect Michael Gallup? They don't respect him, man, because when he's out there running his routes, which is, that's the best thing he does, man, listen, it, it, it's, it's so smooth and easy. It looks like he's not trying, man. You make it look easy. Yeah, make it look too easy, man. When you make things look too easy, people, people are trying to knock you for Yeah, they're trying to be like, man, he's not running hard. Nah, he ain't running hard because he ain't got to. Listen, gotcha. listen, if, if if I can beat you with one hand tied behind my back, why am I going to use my other hand, man? Listen, if I only got to go to level one to beat you, why would I go to level 10, man? You know what I'm saying? So why, when, when, when I, when I got to turn it up, I'm going to turn it up, man. Okay. You know, I watched this guy go against the, the elite of the elite, Alabama, man. And, and if he had better quarterback play, yeah, that was he and he had a bad game in that game. And he was still doing the Tony Browns of the world and the oh yeah, the, the, Averitts. The, the, the Averitts and the Levi Wallace, the Wallaces of the world. Man, he had a, it, it's, it, it's every, it, for him, everything is just so easy, smooth. The little, the little, and the little ah, mm. that he does at the top of his routes that, you know, he breaks people off yeah. like a Kit Kat bar. Yeah. Right? I, the thing I, I, I like most about Gallup mm -hmm. um, is how he uses his hands at the top of his routes, man. It's similar to DeAndre Hopkins where they had that extra uh to get open. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's not too hard. It's, 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 it's ever so slightly. It's ever so slightly. But all that to say, mm -hmm. Calvin Ridley is still my number one receiver. Um, this guy's probably been my number one receiver for the last two, three years. How old is he? He's 24. Mm. Well, he's 23 right now. Gonna be 24, 24. in oh, December, man. I think. Oh man, coming into the league. He, he just seasoned. That's you, what you call it? He's seasoned, okay. man. He's I mean, a seasoned. Your age, fine wine. The, fine wine. Like, we we can put a word on anything to make it sound good, just so y'all know. But go ahead. You know. So you know what I like about Ridley is just the routes. Mm -hmm. It's just the explosiveness in and out of his breaks. Uh, I know the Sparkies. That's what we call them, the Sparkies. They're gonna go Kill to him. his jumps and. And all of this, but my numbers. combine, athletic testing, but that don't matter, man. To me, especially on the offensive side of the football, man, it's, it's how, how do you win? You know, it's not defense, chase and catch football. It's about technician, route running. Mm -hmm. And I think that's what Kevin really has, the extreme route running. Uh, he can catch football, take it to the house, man. He just, he's been the best receiver in college football for, for some time now. It's just Alabama hitting away. Yeah, Alabama doesn't use their receivers, receivers their tight ends right. They didn't have run the quarterback football, play. I would agree with the that. Quarterback play. So you're never going to see these guys reach their star potential. Mm -hmm. uh, we, even, we didn't even see Julio Jones nope. reach his star potential in college. And you see what he did, did in the league. Yeah, I, can, I can't disagree, man. Listen, Calvin Ridley is my number two, man. I just go back to, listen, he... I'm not going to deny anything you said. You, you, you put it out there, man. I just feel like Gallup is the better player, man. I need people... Listen, I need you to go to... The, the Gallup film, mm. take a look at it, mm. and, and, and just watch him, man. And, and remember this, put this in your mind, put this in your head, man. He's doing it ever so easily. Yeah. And it's crazy how it's a lot of people that love Gallup, and there's a lot of people that hey, don't they, even they, have him in their top yeah, five, they, they, not top ten. They, they, don't, don't, rec they don't recognize him. So I, I, the Gallup him. lovers, you mm -hmm. know, Consultative GM, we like Gallup, we love Gallup. We know. We watch the tape, man. So Gallup is, and I think Gallup and Ridley are, are very similar, similar. receivers. Yeah. There's size, everything. I think these guys are mirror images of each other. Ridley is just a little more <laughs> polished than uh, Michael Gallup, man. I disagree, man. You, you we, Listen, I don't know how polished you can be at, 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 at Alabama, man. Like, yeah. yo, when I watch Ridley, I, I, don't even, I don't even look at the place where he's targeted. I'm just okay. watching him and how he runs his routes when he doesn't even get the football. So that's kind of how I evaluate my receivers. It's like, not when you get the ball. I just want to see how you look on every route stem. Like, okay. how's your movements looking? I, I can't deny it, man. I yeah. just, Gallup is, to me, is the better player, man. 
Yep. Toby. Higher ceiling? Gallup? Would you agree on that? Yeah. Higher ceiling? I think Gallup has a higher ceiling. I think it's a higher ceiling. A higher ceiling. Yeah. And, 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 and for you sparky people out there, th there is no number for route running. And for me, that's the number one quality for a receiver is route running because you talk about Jerry Rice. He ain't run fast, but he's the best exactly. receiver ever, right? Yeah. You don't got to be athletic to run a route running. It's, no. it's just an understanding of the game, and like, especially like zone defenses, how to get open in those zone defenses. No, no number's going to tell you that. No. Nah, nah. So, so there you have it, man. That's our Gallup versus Ridley. You two, let us know what you think. Mm -hmm. uh, Who's your number one? Who's your number two? Who's your number three? Since number three is I Gallup. I think he bought Phil Miller. He's the, uh, a, a Gallup guy too, right? So, yeah. you know, he got some Gallup trades, man. You leading the Gallup trade? Yeah, of course, bro. There you go, man. I've been banging that drum since 2016. Wow. Wow. There we have it, man. ConsultatorGM.com.